All right, thank you, Dustin. 13 News at 5 begins with breaking news tonight. Right now, a crash involving at least two Metro Police cars is tying up traffic. This on the south side of Indianapolis during the evening rush. Chase Howell is live there tonight with what he's learned. And Chase, can you tell us anything since your last report? Any update on the officer's conditions? Felicia and Marie, that's what I first and foremost want to get to. That One of the officers that were involved in the crash did suffer some minor injuries, but officers on scene tell me he is going to be okay. As you can see behind me, traffic is moving steadily now. This is just within the last couple of minutes, but prior to all that, the, one, of the, uh, one of the cars, mind you, of the IPD was flipped around facing the opposite way of traffic. The front end of that IMPD vehicle was completely smashed in. Next to it, just like a few feet away, there was another IMPD vehicle with had damage to the back of it. Again, this all, we aren't, we aren't sure of the information right now, but we do know that a PIO is coming to the scene as we speak to give us some more information about what led up to those, those two IMPD cruisers crashing. But again, I'm over here on US 31 South, just on Epler Avenue, where two IMPD vehicles were involved in a crash. One of those officers, again, suffered minor injuries, but he is expected to be okay. That was coming from an officer on the scene. We are expected to have some more information here shortly when a POI, PIO does arrive on scene. But again, traffic has opened up. Things are running smoothly now. That was just within the last five minutes. All right, Chase, thank you so much. PIO being public information officer. That's so we're right. waiting to hear from IMPD. Thank you, Chase.